My name's Matt. Um, I go by Leo Islo when I'm performing as an artist. I'm a producer, singer, songwriter in the electronic genre. Um, yeah, and Holocene asked me a couple of interview questions, so here they are. Well, um, I got a dog at the beginning of quarantine, so that's been huge. Um, you know, just having a very positive life form that gets me out of bed and forces me out of the house and makes me laugh a lot because she's a puppy. Um, so that's been really nice. Um, other than that, rock climbing at the circuit, which don't worry, they're being super safe and cool about it. Uh, wearing masks, social distancing, scheduling things out. Yada yada. Um, reading poetry, which um, this has been one of my latest read was Charles Bukowski. You get so alone at times that it just makes sense. Very appropriate to right now. Um, and then watching some of my favorite artists live stream and show their process and breakdowns of their their uh, like hits. Like disclosure right now is. Amazing. I recommend checking out their live stream if you're an electronic artist. So I revisited Frank Ocean's Blonde and to me it feels just really relevant in this moment. Um, it's like joyful and mournful at the same time. And I just think he's a genius and super inspiring as an artist. Also, this book by Scott Peck called The Road Less Traveled. Um, my dad gave me this book when I was feeling depressed. And um, he said it was something that helped him out many times in his life. Um, so it was like a really personal read and I love what Peck says to have about how we define things and perceive things in the West versus like an Eastern philosophy. and. He has some really interesting outlooks on just life and love and human stuff. <laughs> well, um, I feel far more open to risks than before at this moment. Um, simply because, you know, something like this pandemic comes along and you realize how unpredict unpredictable and crazy and um, short life is. Um, I've finished more music this year than the last three years combined. Um, and um, other than that, I can't really wait to start making music again with people in the studio. Um, I think, you know, prior to this year, I, I felt like I was just a one man band and I was fine with that. But this year, I got really into collaborating before the pandemic hit, and I just can't wait to have that human energy in the studio again. I'm Leo Islo. I'm signing off from this interview. I'm playing a show uh, live streaming from Holocene on Saturday, and it'll be on Twitch and YouTube. And uh, the live stream is from 9 p.m. to midnight PST. So I hope to see you guys then. Um, I'll be doing a live set, a 40 minute live set with um, my guitarist who's gonna join me. And then I'll also be doing a DJ set afterwards and I'm gonna be playing with uh, PDX local Carl Kling. It'll be awesome, it helps support the venue. Hope you guys tune in. Peace.